And K2 women also over 500 metres. And that will be to around 1 o'clock. Then we'll give you a little break. Before 2.15, we'll be starting the 5,000 metre races, starting with the C1 women. So we've got three chunks really to bring you from 8 till 10 tomorrow, from 11 till 1, and from 2.15 to around half past 4. So I do hope you'll be able to join me. Some of you, that'll be on television. For others, that'll be on Planet Canoe. But we'll be bringing a really packed day of racing in Poznan for the second and final World Cup of the season. Then there'll be a bit of a gap. We'll have a good few weeks. And we'll be then bringing you the World Championships from Halifax, Nova Scotia in early August. Can't wait for that. You'll be able to join myself with various guests on Planet Canoe for the World Championships. Right now, though, we've got the KL2 final of 200 metres, and we'll have Andras Rozobora from Hungary in lane one, Emilio Atamanuk from Argentina in two, Christian Volpi from Italy goes in three, Federico Mancarella also from Italy in four, Mikola Sinuk from Ukraine in five, Vuk Radovanovic from Serbia in six, Marcus Swoboda from Austria in seven, Adi Ezra from Israel in eight, and Ahmed Naguib from Egypt in nine. Final of the K2 men, 200 meters. Rods Borda in lane one. Well, he's gonna struggle to keep up with the pace. Certainly going out really, really well. That's lane three, Christian Volpe lost both legs in an accident, scooter accident just a year ago. Always passionate about paddling. Now doing really well in para canoe and I'm sure that we're gonna be seeing much more of him in the future. A little bit more experience is Mikola Sinyuk from Ukraine. He's going really well at the moment in this event. And he takes the win. Wonderful to see Italy in second. Austria takes third. So Mikola Sinuk takes first place. 